topic. Sports Matters TV. Okay, guys, welcome to Packy Ring. First of all, John White, Damon O'Sullivan. First of all, Damon, you know what it's like as a player to win an All-Ireland. Uh, big game against Limerick. Uh, Sunday coming, obviously it's a big fixture. How's the momentum going into this game at the moment? Yeah, look, it's a great. It's, it's always nice to be involved in the business end of this season. Um, we're treating it no differently than we would treat other games. Um, okay, the prize is bigger, ultimately, but we have to keep our feet in the ground and, you know, get our house in order to be in a position to challenge um, on Sunday. There's obviously a great buzz after that Kilkenny win. It was a great game. Do you reckon the extra time will help the lads, obviously, the extra minutes and stuff on that pitch? We had nine guys who hadn't played in Crop Park previous to last Sunday, so yes, the will, it is a bonus that we got, you know, them nine guys got game time. We introduced eight more guys due to the five in normal time in the three in, in additional time so um, yeah from that aspect it's pleasing. And like as you say look you work with the team well you know the team very well you're obviously thrilled of what you've seen so far this season. Very pleased very pleased um, we know of a squad of 37 guys who come in every night give a whole heart to the count of themselves you know match days we can only bring 26 and um, so we're leaving 11 guys at home and that's the hardest part of this job you know it's the 11 guys who can't make that train journey or make that bus journey. They're the guys we feel for because without them 11 guys, we couldn't pick a 26 or first 15. They're giving us everything. They've given us everything since we've come back. And if they didn't, we wouldn't find ourselves in this position. It's obviously great to have the fans back. Look, we know it's not a full capacity, but look, it does help having the Cork fans show for their team. Obviously, that's a big team moving forward. Yeah, look, I think we're in a privileged position um, that we can now have crowds back for games that we us as a Cork team in Limerick we can we can open in the biggest stage with our supporters so you know it's, it's been difficult but it's very very pleasing when we got out of the train last Sunday um, there was a big Cork crowd held on the station they gave the team a big cheer out onto the bus and I think it was the first time all players younger players would have would have seen something like that so it would be great for them to experience that as well and last of all look we're speaking of Cork and all the underage players it's yeah. almost a clean sweep this year look there's a lot on the line there's a lot of big tournaments a lot of uh, things to win but look 21s minus they're all shining and it's looking bright for Cork moving forward yeah I think Noel has done a wonderful squad what wonderful job with his minor squad Pat with the under 20s look it's been successful but there's no point in being in this final if uh, in these finals if we can't win them our focus can be only on our game Pat and Noel will get their own house in order but a rising tide lifts all boats, so it's pleasing. Damn it, all the best Sunday. Thank no you very much. much. Thanks, you are watching Sports Matters TV.